Good afternoon to you. 334 here at the home of the white squirrel. And I'm Wanda Lou. It's a beautiful day outside. We got some very special guests in the studio. It's the Mason Jar Drinkers. Yay. And the crowd roars. Yay. <laughs> You can't hear the crowd. If you had headphones on, you could hear the crowd roaring, but it's like a virtual crowd. They're, they're in the computer. Yeah. All right. We got, we have here with us Josh Carter, Hunter Holmes, Stephen Acker, and Michael Eliezer. I knew I was going to mess that up. That's okay. What if you get a little close to the microphone and talk to me here? Okay. Uh, Josh, that's you? It's Hunter. It's Hunter. Okay, I'm, I'm already messing up. You know who I am. There's only one of me, but there's four of y'all. Yeah. You guys have been, how long have you been playing together as a group? Uh, we started playing together as a group maybe a year and a month or two ago. Um, and Michael just joined on with us uh, back at the beginning of this fall semester. So. All right, and you're playing a small parlor guitar. Yep. How old is that instrument? Uh, it's probably about 75 or 80. Yeah, some authentic so, sound there, because yeah. the type of music that you're doing is kind of old traditional, what do you call it? Uh, it goes by a bunch of different names. You can call it roots music. Um, it's pretty much uh, American folk music from the 20s and 30s of various traditions. Um, anything uh, kind of before big band jazz and kind of before bluegrass and uh, electric blues, all, all the acoustic forms of traditional folk music. When I heard you at Halloween Fest, you were out here in the in the street and mm-hmm. really kicking butt. I was enjoying it. It reminded Thank me you. almost of jug band music. Oh yeah, that's that's definitely one of the traditions we draw a lot from jug and, band music and skiffle. Yep. Yeah, exactly. right in there. I was yep. like, ooh, this is rare for Brevard. Yeah. Yeah. And then you have a mandolin player over there. Why don't you step up to the microphone here? This is Josh Carter. I know this is Josh, right? Yes, ma'am. Yeah, I did good. And you're going to school at Brevard College? Yes, ma'am. What you taking over there? I'm an art major with a Willie Minor. Yeah. Music just kind of fits into everything, doesn't it? Yeah. It does. yeah. All right, where are you from? I'm from Brevard. From Brevard. Yeah, I grew up around here. Thought you might be. <laughs> Carter being a good old music name, too. Yeah. Yeah, like AP and Johnny and what's her, June, June Carter. Yeah, and, maybe, yeah. maybe I'm related. You, you may be. It's, you know, you never know. How long have you been with these guys? Um... About a year and a month. Yeah. You guys sound really good for only having been playing together for a year and a month, from what I, like I heard <laughs> already. And then on bass, we have Stephen Acker. Stephen, that's a big instrument. If you can't make it all the way to the microphone, I, yeah. I certainly understand. How long have you been playing bass fiddle? Uh, I've been playing it for about five or six years now. And you got the hardest job just hauling that thing around. Carrying it. <laughs> and you have to have a vehicle big enough to put it in. Right. Yeah. We all have, our, most of us have trucks. Oh, that's a good thing. So. That's good. Usually when I was in a band, I was the only one with a van. Yeah. You know, I had to yeah. carry all the stuff everywhere. Oh, are you going to college? I'm at Brevard also. Yeah, what are you majoring in? In wilderness leadership. Cool. That's a really good course of study, I yeah. understand. That's a, that's neat. And you guys have been playing at the Contra Dances at the college also. We have. We actually, uh, that's actually how we got started was um, kind of just we all lived together and, and decided to start playing for a little Contra Dance we had out in the lawn in front of our dorm. And then it kind of grew into what it is now, and we we kind of found our found each other through that and made a band. So ah, wonderful fate, destiny. What do you call it? Symbiotic uh, something. Yeah, serendipity. That's the word. <laughs> New brain. First day. Contra dancing for those who have never been initiated is a very energetic form of traditional dancing. I tried it one time, almost died, gave it up. But uh, it is a lot of fun to participate in. Very um, aerobic. Would you say? Yeah. Because yeah. you, you, you have to move because yeah, everybody yeah. around you is moving. And I thought I was going to get trampled. I went to one at Warren Wilson College, oh, yeah. and the, yeah, the old that's, one over in the gym. That's one of the more energetic ones around. Is it is, is Brevard's not quite as energetic? Brevard's or? Is, is smaller. It's smaller. But, and maybe a little less energetic. The people at Warren Wilson are a little crazy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no. <laughs> we love the Warren Wilson dance. We've all yeah. been gone to that a few times. That's kind of like the alternative uh, uh, college crowd over there. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, it's, yeah, it's a funny college crowd. Yeah, it is. Michael, step on up. Your instrument's a little bit smaller. He, Michael's on the fiddle, the regular size one. How long have <laughs> you been playing fiddle? Um, I've played the fiddle for about 16 years now. Yeah. I started with classical and then switched over to bluegrass and stuff, and I just play a little bit of everything. Oh, neat. So you just picked it up. And how did you get interested in this particular kind of music? Um, I like to play all kinds of stuff, and then I met these guys at a college like introduction weekend last year and played a little bit with uh, Hunter and Steve. And then when I showed up this semester, we just sort of got together and started playing. 
Where else are you all playing besides the contra dances? You have some other gigs lined up, or are you just uh, playing around for folks who will listen? Ah, uh, yeah, the man with the plan yeah. here, Josh Carter. Man with the plan. I don't know. <laughs> um, well, we're playing tonight at the contra dance right. on campus, and uh, tomorrow evening we're playing at Nolly at, uh, during the Twilight Tour. Excellent. And let's see what else we have going on. Uh, I guess next weekend, hopefully, we're playing at the Whimsical Art Sale. Okay. Out, uh, near Mud Divers. Hmm? And uh, and we're playing down in Lawrence. You want to say something about that? I don't know. Lawrence, yeah, South Carolina. I don't know if anybody from Lawrence, South Carolina is listening, but that's <laughs> definitely that's a that's a show that we got uh, plant, uh, in the works now. Is down in South Carolina where I'm from. So that's next Friday, I think. Isn't it? Well, I'm from South Carolina too. How about ah, that? <laughs> yeah, sand lappers. We have to stick together. Yeah. All right, let's do one. Why don't you guys do one for us, and then we'll talk some more. All How's right. that? Here they are, the Mason Mason Jar Jank Drink. I can't even say it. Mason. I haven't been drinking any. The Mason Jar Drinkers. Get it. 